guys, it is finally here. My vlog of the awesome $3 million charity Fortnite tournament that happened last week in LA and it was absolutely amazing. But that's not all. I've also got some footage of me on the official E3 live stream talking about the games I'm excited for. The first time myself and Ninja played duos together. And then on top of that, after the tournament, there was a huge party royale, one of the biggest parties I've ever been to that was completely Fortnite themed all within this vlog it is going to be so good. If you're new to the channel, make sure you're subscribing for daily Fortnite videos. Give it a thumbs up if you're excited for this vlog. A big thank you to Game who are sponsoring this video. They've got a load of amazing deals on games that are actually showed and revealed at E3, including the Call of Duty Black Ops 4 Specialist Edition, which includes 1,100 COD points, bonus digital content, and access to the private beta, which will be going live this year that I cannot wait to get hold of. You can also pre-order Marvel's Spider-Man Special Edition, which has has a load of bonus content in it, including a custom PlayStation 4 theme and also a load of skins for Spider-Man himself. They also have the Shadow of the Tomb Raider Croft Edition, which is only available at game, which includes a steelbook, art cards, and some currency for the DLC. So there's loads of stuff going on at game. If you're excited for all this new stuff, you can check out the pre-orders and everything down below in the description on the game website. And also just a friendly reminder, if you're looking to go to a gaming event here in the UK and you haven't been to one before, or you're just looking for another one to go to, Insomnia is one of the biggest UK gaming events and Insomnia 63 is happening again this year in the Birmingham NEC Centre from the 24th to the 27th of August with loads of games to try out, loads of YouTubers attend as well so if you want to get tickets for that I'll link down below to insomniagamingfestival.com so loads of awesome stuff going on. Thanks again to Game, but we've got loads of awesome vlog footage to share with you guys now. I really hope you enjoy this one. As I said, give it a big fat thumbs up if you do. Without further ado, let's jump into the E3 live stream, the Fortnite tournament and the awesome party, all right here. So guys, we're behind the scenes. We're checking out the stadium before we jump on, before the tournament begins. You can see behind the 100 setups for all of the 50 pros, streamers, YouTubers like myself, and obviously the other 50 celebrities as well. It is unreal in the middle of a football stadium. Such an amazing, and amazing venue. There's an after party happening here as well, which we're all going to be going to. We've obviously got to focus on this tournament first. We've got some tactics going down. We could play this super safe, super slow, and just play out for the position. Or we could go in, try and go for some kills, and try and spice it up a little bit. I haven't actually had a chance to meet my partner Pete yet, so I think I need to head on down and actually introduce myself hang out with him, get a little bit of uh, some tactics going down first, but a little bit of an early preview of where it's all gonna be going down. Absolutely unreal, so excited. So we're in the player lounge now, which is like underneath the stadium. Everywhere you look is players in the tournament. If I spin around, you'll be able to see so many people, and it's so good, honestly, the best thing about this is having so many players and so many people in the community in one place. I haven't felt this or had so many content creators in one place since Call of Duty events, back in the day when everyone would just be playing Call of Duty and it'd all come together in all the events. So just look, spin around everywhere. Look at these scrubs. They're going down. All of these guys, all of these guys are going to get beaten here today. But before the tournament starts, we're going to head over to the E3 live stream. Yeah. The competition is strong, so it's going to be a really interesting one. Who are you guys paired up with tomorrow? Uh, I'm paired up with Pete Wentz from uh, Fall Out Boy. Boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are Pete. you guys buds? How did that happen? Yeah, we've been DM DMing each other a little bit, but the thing is, since okay. arriving in LA, I've got no time to play with him. So I yeah. think it's just going to be on the day, gelling, trying to trying yeah. to play as well. That chemistry. Right? Yeah, exactly. I think we're constantly trying to get better and better, and we have to grow with the community of Fortnite players yeah. that are getting better up. and better yeah. every single day as well. But this is a very special tournament in the fact that when we jump into a game of Fortnite, maybe 10%, 5% of the people in that lobby are really good. Yeah. This is... I mean, excluding the celebrities who will be variables, all of the pros are very, very yeah. good. So 50% yeah. of those players are good. very good players. Are you going to get to go to the show floor? Are you going to be all Fortniteing out? Um, I definitely want to spend some time on the show floor. I always try and sneak my way into the Nintendo booth. I, I mentioned it earlier. Flash, yeah. And I'm like, let me play all of these games early. So yeah. hopefully I have time for that. Al, you're sticking around because I think you're going you're gonna to play with Ninja for the first time. Yeah, yeah, that is the plan of action. Um, I'm going to be using a control. Okay, like, that's all like, I know. Like Mellow, right? Yeah, exactly. The great okay. thing is with, with uh, Fortnite is that you can just plug it in and play as if I was sat on my console at home. I mean, we so. could be playing right now on our phones, right? Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> like, that's it's all crazy cross thing play, about right? It. We bring it all together. All right. Well, uh, thanks for hanging out, guys. You good? Nope. Yep. 
<laughs> oh man. All right, that was it. And we're good now. Bandages. Two mid, two mid. Oh, oh, dude, I'm coming. Try to stay alive. Oh, seven. Where is he? He's on me. Nice. Bro. Here, Woo! climb out a little. What do you think about the llama changes, man? I think it was too harsh. I agree. One why, million. why 200? Such a massive change. Hey, we're going to go from 500 to 200. I think they need to bring it back up. I think, I think. Epic uh, Games, listen, listen to us. <laughs> right. I was saying like 250, 250 in solos, 400 in, in duos, and then 500 in squad. See, that made sense. Yo, there's another llama. Are you serious? Where? Uh, East 90. Double Two. llama? Yo, how sick would it be is if the llamas could move? Like, what if they that were like, cool. like, like, just yeah, like, yeah, throwing, yeah. like nibbling on the ground? I like that. So they've made the ice cream truck that you could find dotted around in the map in Fortnite in real life, even with the ice cream cone coming out the top of it. <laughs> and they've also made the actual battle bus that you fly into the map on in real life. We're here a little bit early, so we're going to just like sneak around and have a look before it gets filled with everyone else. This is so cool. The real life battle bus we snuck in to get really, really close. These guys are hyped. They said they've been waiting all day to watch the tournament. I think they're literally going to fill the football stadium with people watching, supporting. It's going to be a crazy atmosphere. Here we are, guys. <laughs> We're actually on the ground now. We're literally walking over to where you're going to play. I think I'm more nervous than Ali. Yeah, you, you you're are not actually. I'm, I'm super chilled, like. <laughs> I'm having an anxiety attack. I'm like worrying for you. I want you to do well so much. I guess it's like doing what I do every day, playing the game, but in a real. Oh my god, it is so hot. It is what you're gonna bake. Like, I'm gonna show you guys where we're walking to. He's like gonna be playing up there, but it's totally open. You're gonna burn, Baba. I need to get my sunglasses. This is nuts. You need to get Factor 50 all over your head and face. I'm gonna be in the audience, like watching him and like cheering for him. I think I'm actually gonna be up here. So I'm gonna be in the shade, not burning, but Hot Ali is gonna be legs, burning. <laughs> so everyone's finding their seats, they're getting sat down. We're actually quite close to the front, so we've got a movie here from Spain. Oh. We've got Katarga from Spain as well, great player. We've got Nick Merckx next to us, one of the greatest console players in Fortnite. Also such a nice guy that I met for the first time. Got my controller, got this thing ready to start. <laughs> Hopefully gonna give me at least some advantage against all of these PC players. It's so, gonna be tough, Baba. It's gonna be tough. Giving you so many good luck vibes right now. They're coming out of my eyes. Is this where you're playing? This is where I'm playing, baby. Oh man, look what you're gonna be looking out on. This is it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This wow. will be our view. Wow, 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 wow. Fortnite all the way along here. Okay guys, we're starting. There he is. Shotguns that didn't get nerfed. The zone. The zone. The zone Nick, is you didn't in. see him. Nick. Oh! oh! Musuk is tearing it up right now. The structures. Oh my goodness. The rocket goes down. He's able to stay alive because he used the bounce. Yeah! yeah! So stylish. Wow. Make some noise for Noah J. So this event is actually split into three games with only the last one meaning anything. So we've just had a practice solo game. Maybe able to see on the screen behind me, it was won by Noah J. Originally a Zombies YouTuber, transitioned really well to Fortnite on PC. He's, he's really good player. So GG, he's won the solos game. It's the only solos game it's gonna be. We're now jumping into a practice duos game. So how'd your first game go? What place did you come? Game at 61, I hid. I shot at a guy and immediately after I shot at him, he started building and I was like, and he was building nice. And I was like, I think I might have shot at a bro. <laughs> I think that was and the wrong so, guy. And then so I got hunted. Okay, that yeah. makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I came 60 something as well. I took someone out. I think Ninja sniped me in the back. And then 
He didn't back finish back me, yeah, but an egg rolled around me knew where I was, and a guy shot me with a scar. Yeah, yeah, so he had a scar really early yeah. on. So, I mean, it's only a practice, and now we're going to jump into our first duo. And I think we'll, we'll implement some strategy, and I think we need to make sure that we've got. I think we're going to have to land in the main plate a lot of stuff. Yeah, and just get as much stuff as we can at the beginning. We may have to fight off a team or two, but I think it'll be worth it. Listen, I don't want to carry you the whole way fighting everybody off. Right? It's, just, it's just like what I was thinking going into it. <laughs> it's going to be good fun. This one, next one won't mean anything. The final duos game is the only one that counts for anything. So hopefully it goes well. I'll update you guys after game two. We'll see how we can do it. Allier going all the way to north side, Wayland Woods. Risky reels. It's going to be a very open field in the middle of the map. When we have what, what looks like three, four teams around Tilted Towers. We get a lot going. Junk Junction starts just starting to fall. Drop like flies. You actually have one in front. Oh Ali no! Knocked down. Ali A is in a world of hurt. All right, P, li listen close. I need you to pick up a gun. <laughs> the, you go the disrespect! Oh wow. Muzo, no just chill. munching away popcorn. Lightly salted, a little bit of butter. Pete went to the rescue. He's going Come for on, it. Pete. I think that you may have just telegraphed where he's coming from. Oh, this is this is gonna hurt. The shots are going all over the place, but there you have it. Ali A, Pete wins. He out of here. Right, so our first uh, proper duos game together. We landed Risky Reels, and so many other teams came in with us. Like, I think there was about a good 10 of us. Some of them bailed. We landed with Muse out, and they landed on shields. We separated, which was something we learned we shouldn't do. We're learning so much, you know. This is the first time this many great players have all played together. This meant like something a bit spectacle. Game two over, going to the final game, and strategy is just land in the most weird place ever. Yep. Stick together all the time. Yep. Grab a load of materials. Twitter says we need revenge. Yeah, yeah. So we, we need definitely revenge. need revenge. If we come up against Muse out again, we're taking them down, and we're aiming for at least. Top 50 percent at least 25th and above would be ideal. Okay, let's go. Right, it's happening. It's, it's happening, guys. We're gonna do this. Taking shots, Ninja. All he has to do is breathe on him, and he's gonna get the win. Ninja gets the win. Let's go! Charity here at the Fortnite Pro Am. Him and Marshmallow come out on top. Hey guys, we did it. I ended up, we wanted to become at least top 50%, so 25th and above as duos. I think I ended up coming 5th or 6th. Fortunately, Pete, my teammate, got taken out quite early on, but I played my the exact game plan I wanted to play, which was be sneaky, not getting any gunfights until I needed to, and then eventually I had to take someone out. They had a legendary RPG, picked a, took down another person, they went for a revive, took another person down, and then I was left with basically stuck in my own base with not much more I could do, but I'm so happy with the position we ended up getting. Pete, my teammate, was awesome, and just an unreal vibe. I think the competitive scene for Fortnite is going to be huge, and this just shows it. With all of the success here, the amazing vibes, the amazing people, it was unreal. Thank you for everyone that's treated me, thank you for everyone that came and supported me, really appreciated it, and ultimately a load of money raised for charity, you can't ask much more than that. He's literally the luckiest, the luckiest still signing stuff for everybody. <laughs> I took out Willy Rex. It was bad. We both know Willy Rex. He came sick. I came fifth. It was good. It was good. It was a really, really, really fun tournament. And you enjoy watching? Yeah, I was screaming from the crowd, and like everybody I was with was like, I can't believe he's top 50 with a controller. I can't believe he's top 40, top 30, top 20, top 10, and then he came fifth. But like, I can't believe he did that with a controller. It was, it was, it was crazy. It was crazy. And I think maybe I could have lasted a little bit longer, but I was by myself. I, yeah. I took on the two of his team. Yeah, I took yeah. on Woody Rex's teammate. And at that point, like, the ring was off me. I had to move up. They were all above. There yeah. wasn't really much I could do. They'd all built so high. And also, like, like Ninja and his teammate had lived near to the end for, like, the match before as well. Like, they knew how to play together. And they'd practiced before. Yeah. So, like, you, you, the ones who stepped against you, it's just amazing that you got 80k for the video. Yeah. That's it's, what it's all about. It's crazy. I'm so proud. I'm a bit, like... 
dreams, but I'm pumped. Now's a crazy after party. Like we oh, yeah. Like llamas in the sky. Like flamethrowers. Should look amazing. This yeah, yeah. Cool.